Merry Christmas, everyone. Welcome to our winter wonderland. Come on in, take a look at this, what we've done this year. Hope everyone has had a ma an amazing year. It's been a fun and festive one. We've changed everything up again this year. So I want you all to take a look and I hope that you guys like everything. Got, you know, our archway that everyone loves. I did a kind of retro vintage this year. And then this may be one of my favorite rooms in the house. Um, it's got all of my glass ornaments. I just absolutely love them. The tree spins. We've got the old timey lights on them. I had to keep adding trees because I kept finding ornaments that I liked. And in the kitchen, we kind of had uh, done Santa Claus, gingerbread theme. Of course, I always put things from my childhood up here that I just love and want to, to see, and it just brings back some awesome memories. back here we've got the tree again I mixed in a lot of black and white I love it I think it's so much fun and then just some simple fun pieces in here and a painting that a friend made me that I absolutely just adore And then we'll go on into the living room. Excuse me. Did some more black and white in here with just traditional colors. Super fun and festive. Santas and nutcrackers. And of course our, our trusty uh, reindeer that our elf Chippy brought for the boys. And everyone, this is Wheezy. She is our new puppy this year. She wasn't in the video last year. And then Sparky's over here. They both had a rough day of playing and running, so they're kind of worn out. And then come on back here. I have the Hallmark tree that started when I was a kid. I have all kinds of them and then my boys pick out new ornaments every year to add to it. They all have motion and sound and just it's a fun tree. Some of them are battery powered so even if the lights are off the boys will come in and just push a button and something will make noise. So they um, they love this tree and I, it makes me happy that they I, when I hear those uh, sounds that they do. So my bedroom is probably my second favorite room this year, and it is from my favorite movie, Christmas Vacation. We've got Clark on the wall, and we've got the tree, just like I tried to get it exactly like I, they did, and um, with all the vintage ornaments and things like that. And then, of course, Clark, an artist, made him and absolutely love him. And we've got Aunt Bethany on the other side. Oh, oh. there's our squirrel jumping out. And 
And then just some other things. Everything in this room is Christmas vacation, whether a punch bowl or cat. And then this tree is all Griswold or Christmas vacation ornaments that I've collected through the years. And then this is my Christmas vacation village. It's kind of nice to have it all together and out. And then come on in to, excuse me, to the bathroom. The boys really love this room. It's always fun to do this room. I know it's kind of weird to decorate a bathroom, but we love it. It's nice and festive. And we'll go in here and see what the boys themes. I'm sure you guys remember the boys get to pick their themes each year. So this year, Luke has done the sports that he plays. So he plays basketball, he skis, he does tennis and golf. So these are just some of the things from all of his favorite sports that he does. And then we have the Home Alone Lego house, which is amazing. Some good friends did this for me because I... Um, could not get it done and just the detail is is unreal in that house it's so great so we're gonna leave that up all year i'm gonna i'm gonna move it downstairs to the christmas room and then come on in oh i'm real excited to show you all this room this is the dog's tree has all ornaments that are our that are the their breed this is a special one a best friend had this made for us with our dog Sparky and Wheezy painted. And then these are their Christmas pictures. So I think that's really cool and really fun. And we'll go see what Evan chose. And he wanted candy and all things fun. So that is what we did. All kinds of sweet treats in here. He has a sweet tooth just like his daddy. So we have got all kinds of fun things in here. We mixed in some really cool nutcrackers. And then of course his tree arch. And it's got donuts, donuts and candy all over it. Let's go check out downstairs. We tried to keep everything fresh and new this year and every year. So, We've got Santa flying. And then you come on down. This is our family tree that we all put up together. It's just different ornaments that have been given to us and things throughout the years. Pictures and things like that. So, and now we, I did Grinch in this, the kids room this year. which I thought was kind of fun to do and um, freshen up. Didn't get to use all my Grinch pieces. We got to use most of them. And I think it's real appropriate for the kids' room. And then in here is our office. And I've got all my New York ornaments that I love. Keep them up all the time. Had to add a new tree this year. And there's the Grinch back there. All right, and 
We'll check out the Christmas room. Haven't changed much in that. That's just a lot of my favorite things that I like to keep out throughout all the year. But it's still fun to see and get freshened up. And here's just all some a few of my favorite things, favorite artists. And I collect um, three wise men, so I have several of them that I keep on display all the time. Last but not least, we're going to go into our uh, my nativity room. This is a nativity that I gave my grandmother years ago for her birthday, and she has passed now, so it really um, honors me to be able to display it. I have some really amazing memories of these ornaments with her and decorating them, so this room really means a lot to me. I hope you guys have an absolute amazing holiday season and a wonderful new year. And uh, I appreciate all the views and all the great comments. So you all have a very Merry Christmas.